welcome to 200forexpips.com I'm just making this video in order to clear one thing with you I received some of the uh, emails from my subscribers and also some of the people uh, traders contact me through my website corner and they, what they say is that uh, they ask uh, about the uh, that what should be the accuracy of their trading on a monthly basis so guys first of all I'm just going to highlight uh, some rules in front of you people because it's important that you you should not uh, you should not break these rules because uh, uh, these are the main tips and tricks that how to trade forex okay first of all you should note that you should do not uh, do over trading over trading really kills in the forex market I suggest you never to do um, over trading so what is the best size of uh, best quantity for the trading on a daily basis so guys uh, if you watch my uh, videos on YouTube and uh, the mirror there are some uh, subscribers who are following me from even more than nine months and you will come to know that I keep my uh, trading size like three to four trades a day so what 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 is this uh, why I just keep uh, three to four trades a day because Forex is a very risky market and we do not want to uh, place our uh, place our trades blindly do not trade blindly that's a simple that's a simple rule okay the next thing trade with reasons if you do not have any reason then I do not suggest you uh, to trade for example um, yesterday I have when I have sent my signals report I have told everyone to uh, just keep your lot size low because there are some inexperienced persons in the market and they are my subscribers so I just suggested them that do not uh, go with a high lot size today because it's a very risky day for trading yesterday but I find opportunity to make good profits in the uh, in the morning uh, right in the morning but after that I I have not placed any kind of trade and I waited till night that where I need to go for a trade so the market was quite risky throughout the day so I left trading on on that time and just I came back uh, at night and I have placed two trades and, and these trades are based on scalping so guys here um, I, I suggest you that 80% of your trades uh, should be based on uh, long trades long trades mean uh, I suggest that you use overly one chart okay and 20% of your trade setups uh, on a monthly basis I'm not talking about the daily or weekly uh, they should be based on scalping so how you can do this this is very easy that you should have a very good trading system like me that I'm using and you just need to find an opportunity and the opportunity how it comes simple is that I say I, I will just say that you are a fisherman and the forex market forex market is just like uh, forex market is just like a fish in the sea and you are just uh, you are just sitting here and you are just waiting for for the fish to come into your zone when the fish will come into your then you will hunt if the fish is like far away for example let's talk about here uh, for example I talk that fish is here and you are just standing here then this is not a, a place to hunt okay so it's better to uh, go uh, let the things uh, leave for the next day and come back okay so guys what I have talked in my discussions that three to four trades uh, uh, trades a day so how you can do this most of the people come up with hundred dollar two hundred dollar three hundred dollar that's not a recommended capital for forex investment so if you want to uh, do three to four trades a day it means that you need to go with the handsome amount and I suggest that you should have a minimum uh, $5,000 minimum account in order to place three to four trades a day so for example let's say if we compare that a person who is uh, opening uh, account of $500 with Forex then it means that if you want to very uh, if you want to make good profits then he need to uh, to place at least in my point of view that 10 trades a day so here risk factor will increase that's a very simple thing that he is basically uh, higher higher in a higher risk and the person who is in a who is dealing with three to four trades he is basically uh, uh, facing a very low risk so it's not about the lot size I do not uh, say anyone I, I prefer to use eight lot size but it depends that where you are going to 
uh, place a eight lot size. Some people talk that you uh, you uh, you place a very high lot size. This is not about the forex trading, guys. This is the forex trading that you need to go with three to four trades a day. So what happen is that when you are going to place ten trades a day, and out of tra tra uh, ten trades, your one trades goes negative, then it will keep your all uh, profit from the other nine trades because you are just basically doing a very little little scalping and you must be collecting a very little profit so this is never recommended so guys i suggest everyone that you should have a good size of account i suggest that even if you have a, a very good account equity to then go with a 30 uh, 30 thousand dollar account or 47 thousand dollar account because these are the accounts that i have traded and these are very good accounts for making profits and uh, trust me if you will uh, suffer from loss any day then it's it's it's, it's really not uh, no worry uh, there is no worry to uh, there is really no need to worry about anything because you will be quickly able to uh, uh, you get your money back from the trading market because you will have a lot of funds uh, in your trading account uh, even if you bear some loss okay one more thing now uh, that's the analysis that how many trades on a monthly basis so guys I trade like 70 trades a month okay so if your success rate is anything anything uh, I mean just a second please if you are getting anything less than 60 to 6 positive trades okay i'm talking about the positive trades this should be the only negative trades for your month if you are just talking about the forex then i suggest that out of every four, uh, 70 trades you should not ha you should not have more than four negative trades in a month that's that's very very important guys i'm just focusing this thing again that if you are getting seven eight ten out of 70 trades then it means that you need a medicine for your forex trading so medicine comes up in the form of trading system either you are using a very poor trading system either uh, you need forex coaching either uh, for example uh, you do not have it's not about uh, all time about the trading system sometimes you also need to go with your knowledge so if you are lacking your knowledge then it means that you are not do doing good so it's important to gain reasonable knowledge because i'm, I'm not talking about uh, when i uh, i coach different type of people on a daily basis i take uh, seven to eight uh, hourly sessions a day and it's not about uh, throwing them a lot of theories and uh, unusual explanations no forex is not about theories forex is not about a lot of explanations it is not about a very uh, very heavy strategies that will require a lot of judgment and uh, financial and technical analysis from your side no it's not like this guys this forex is very simple if you come up with tricks the person who is successful in forex is the one who has good tricks even he know one trick and his trick is valid then guys he can be he can be very heavy in the forex market and he will be in the list of the person of 15 percent who are successful with the forex so guys these are the common mistakes which people do they start their trading from hundred dollar three hundred to three hundred dollar never recommended come up with a good size of equity you should have a very good trading system you should have a very good knowledge and you should have a very good mentor who can uh, who can help you okay one more thing uh, that should be the number of trades anyways if you have a very small account uh, like uh, two thousand dollar, thousand dollar, seven hundred, eight hundred. Then uh, the person with the such account is always risky, and uh, of course that your trades must exceed from mine that I take on a daily basis. So you should keep in your mind that a person with the lowest equity in the forex market is facing high risk as compared to the person who is just going to place three to four trades a day. Look, guys forex trading is a very good business and you know that i make daily profits on a consistent basis that's very easy there is no need to do a do job anymore there is no need to start any business and go outside your home and do something uh, you you buy a building at the rent and start your own business no there is no requirement for all this you can just make your handsome money from your home all you need is to that that you first need a, a very good trading system and you should have a very good knowledge and then you go live and until unless you are not comfortable you can uh, trade on a demo account that's recommended 
anyways guys i have pointed some of the uh, some of the mistakes that common traders do and i hope you will not uh, uh, you will uh, not uh, make this mistakes anymore anyways uh, you can see a trading system that i use for my trading and you can also check out my um, the previous video so if you need anything uh, my trading system coaching and if you need to subscribe to the signal service then please send your inquiries on uh, info at the rate of 200 forexwebs.com uh, this is uh, this email is provided in the description of the video and also please subscribe my youtube channel like my videos and visit my website 200 forexwebs.com thank you for watching the video best of luck